So what's up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel once again. You know I appreciate having you here. Stick around for day three in the Picos. We have a little bit of fun, even though my camera keeps playing silly buggers, keeps turning itself off, losing sound, that sort of thing. Anyway, that's the reason not why the footage is a little bit in and out for this one. But we're gonna have fun nevertheless. Well I'm having fun anyway. You guys are not here, you're just watching it. Unlucky, never mind, get yourselves over here. It is a good place to ride, really good fun. What a stunning place to ride, eh? Beautiful. It's 10.30 in the morning. Let's see what the temperature is at the moment. 17 degrees, absolutely perfect. A nice alpine, fresh chill in the air. Don't know what the plan is today, apart from uh, riding gorgeous roads like this. But this afternoon, we're going to attempt some off-road stuff. I mean, look at this place. It is absolutely beautiful. It's breathtaking. The good thing is, you can ride this on any bike. These roads on little calf racers will be fantastic. Yesterday, we were out having a coffee, and a load of Spanish guys turned up on old 1960s calf racers. And I thought, what a great way to spend the afternoon. Never gets old. Absolutely amazing for riding. And for looking, of course. Right? <laughs> First bit of off-road, purely by mistake. I saw the little lip on the edge of the road and I thought I'm going to drop down there and if I try to get straight back on, it's not going to happen. So we're going to have to just gas it through the dirt and get back on. No dramas, but it probably looked good from behind. That'll teach me to look at the scenery. in the clouds. We're currently at 3,343 feet. According to this here, anyway. I didn't measure it. We're all here, most of the group, we're going over the mountain now, we're going off-road, over the mountain, a little bit different. We're christening the Africa Twin, off-road in the Picos. I haven't been off-road on a big bike for probably three years, so it should be fun, entertaining. Do you want, do you want me to put you on some nice settings, what you've done, are you cool with it? Uh, what have you got? I'll just leave it as this. I won't need the wheelie control off, will I? And traction, really.
is the life. Bit dusty. This is what it's all about. This is what I came for. Off-road, through the mountains. Life doesn't get much better than this, my friends. Morning cow. Afternoon, I should say. Whew. These are heavy old beasts. Hey! <laughs> it's a little bit sketchy here. A little bit loose on the rocks. mate. Whew. That hurt me arms that did. Dusty. It's better I can see the rocks now. When you're too close, it's so dusty, you get it all wrong. Whew! Come on, knackered me out, that did. My arms are dead. I'm pumped. Oh, f***ing yeah. hell. Oh, I couldn't see f***ing cool. I had to hang back because I couldn't see anything. What, dust? Yeah. Wow. Oh, here we are for mountain. A little bit of off-roading. But she's going to go down and see where the rest are. We've lost them. Pete's gone back. Only three of us made it to this point. It's been silent for about half hour. I'll come and help you. It's a little bit sketchy. Oh, I'll turn you off because I'm going to help Richie. Richie's going back down the mountain. Pete left about 15 minutes ago, 10-15 minutes ago. 
Richie's going down to see where they are. I'm staying here because I'm too lazy to turn around. Hopefully everyone's all right. Right, so back to me. Yeah, stuck up a mountain. I'm not stuck, the bike works, but worst places to be stuck. Just gonna have a pew. Let's have a little sit down. Let them sit down, catch some rays. Wow, this route so far, we've only been on it 10, 15 minutes. A little bit tricky. It's a little bit slippery because of the boulders and the rocks, the loose bits, but Africa Twins doing all right, we're doing all right. I'm not gonna say it, but yeah, I'm upright. Hopefully, as I said, everyone's all right and the rest of them be here soon. Otherwise, I'm gonna camp here or carry on. I don't think I'm gonna go back down. I think I'm just gonna carry on. <laughs> be Billy no mates, because I came here for this. This is what I came here to do, this off-road bit. So we're gonna persevere. Anyway, I'll check in with you soon. I think that's how it goes. Adios, amigos. Right, eucalypts are sweet in. We're now down to three. We've had two crashes and the rest have turned back. I've been here for probably nearly an hour now, but we're gonna carry on. Me, Pete, Richie, we're gonna carry on over the pass. It is like riding on marbles. This stuff is just awful at the moment. pump as well. I can't believe they did this on VFRs. Lunatics. For those interested, I've got it in manual mode, just flicking between one and two. Chugging up, riding the torque. Get more over this side. Gives me more room for error. <laughs> Suspension's not liking this. <laughs> Woo! Oh, there. Got any belly pan left? Eh? Got any belly pan left? Got any what belly pan? Yeah. Richie, this is the life. <laughs> this is the life. Is this the road all the way up here? She's doing well for a maiden voyage off road. We've just ridden up, you probably can't see it on the GoPro, just zigzags all the way across the top of this mountain on the 
I should say in this valley between the mountains but we're at 4,900 feet at the moment and we got the road snaking off there as I said just the three of us left myself Pete English and Mr Richie Vida and these idiots are on road tyres <laughs> oh. That rock is there. Huh? There's no good place where that rock can be there. That's a good point. Why is that rock there? It's obviously just left as it, yeah, it does. it's dissolved. Unless, what's his name? Asterix is mate. Yeah. <laughs> it's come up and dumped it there. I mean, life doesn't really get much better than this. first now rolling down on the engine braking this Africa Twin's got really really good engine braking in manual mode Sport 2 just rolling down in one haven't actually touched the brakes yet which is great just brakes and gravel never good there we go into second don't know why I'm telling you this just thought I'd narrate and as you know off-road, I'm not a fan of going downhill. Wash the dust off. And we're running road pressures as well. saying this is part of the TET, the Trans-European Trail. It's very nice it is to, I mean, spectacular views, but it's always wise keeping your eyes on the track. <laughs> amazing, absolutely amazing. steep downhill even with full brakes it doesn't want to stop very sandy as well that's Andy <laughs> hey I'm here all week I'm not I'm here till Sunday
currently above the clouds. the road down and that's the cloud base <laughs> it's coming in really quick as well don't know if you can see that on the camera but we're gonna be riding down in this off-road all good fun there they are the mysterious people of the mountains Cloud cover has now come in. <laughs> you can't see the road much. All part of the fun. This bike is amazing. And these tyres, Trek Rider tyres, fantastic, brilliant. So thank you very much to Avon for supplying the tyres for this one. They work well on the tarmac, work well in the dirt. I am definitely going to consider getting these again. I really like them. Anyway, we're going to wrap the video up. Don't forget to subscribe, to like, to share, to do all those things that you need to do. Also hit that notification bell so you guys can get the drop on these videos. I shall see you on the next one. You know I love you all. Stay safe. Fish out. Get all your bags. Get out my house. I don't want your stuff around. I never did you wrong, but you did me wrong. So go ahead, get gone. Get all your bags. Get out my house. I don't want your stuff around. I never did you wrong, but you did me wrong. So go ahead and get gone.